Indonesia's Supreme Court has approved regulatory changes on the age of candidates in regional elections amid speculation that President Joko Widodo's 29-year-old son is seeking to run in the upcoming Jakarta elections. A petition was filed with the court in April calling for the rules to be changed so that candidates could be 30 years old when they are inaugurated rather than on the date when the election commission first confirms their bid. Mr. Suharto, a spokesman for the court, said on May 30 the court has approved the changes filed by the Garuda Party, an obscure group aligned with the ruling coalition. It is so that Indonesia can be led by youngsters. Said Mr. Teddy Gasnadi, a Garuda spokesman. The surprise ruling comes as Mr. Widodo's younger son, Mr. Kaysang Pangarip, 29, is being promoted as a potential candidate for deputy governor of Jakarta, where regional elections will be held this November. Mr. Kaysang, best known for his fried banana business and recent appointment as head of Indonesia's Solidarity Party PSI, does not turn 30 until December. Recent social media posts have featured mock election posters of Mr. Budisatrio Jaiwandono, the nephew of President-elect Prabowo Sabianto, alongside Mr. Kaysang. Mr. Prabowo's Jarindra Party and PSI officials did not immediately respond to questions about Mr. Kaysang's candidacy, but the posters were shared on Jarindra's official Instagram page and by a top Jarindra official on May 29. The court ruling follows concern about the extent of dynastic politics in the world's third-largest democracy and moves to undermine the integrity of its top courts. In February, Mr. Prabowo, a former military commander, won the presidential election in a landslide with his running mate, Mr. Gibran Rekabaming Roka, Mr. Widodo's elder son. Mr. Gibran's candidacy was enabled by controversial changes to the election law, a revision that was also proposed by the Garudi Party. But legal experts say that for Mr. Kaysang to run as deputy governor in Jakarta, changes would have to be made not only to the election regulations but also to the regional election law. Since the age requirement is regulated in the regional election law, if there's any appeal, it should be filed to the Constitutional Court, not the Supreme Court, said legal expert T.T. Engrini. So Kaysang should not be able to register in the 2024 regional election, she said.